Every athlete's dream is to compete at the highest level of their sport. The Super Bowl, World Series, Stanley Cup. One athlete from right here in Boise is gearing up to compete on cycling's biggest stage for the second year in a row. 23-year-old Matteo Jorgensen will compete in next month's tour. Before the race, his family gathered to raise some hometown support for Matteo on the Basque Block in downtown Boise. News Channel 7's Jude Binkley was there. Jude, why the Basque Block as he gets ready to ride in the Tour de France? Well, Doug, the Basque Block region or the Basque region has a very unique connection to this year's tour. Uh, the course changes every year, and this year it's starting in the Basque Country, where Jorgensen's cycling team is based. Now, last year, Jorgensen finished 21st out of 176 riders, and he even had a couple of top five stage finishes. Not easy to find the breakaway. Mateo's riding great. It's super fulfilling for us as parents knowing that he's fulfilling his dreams. Dreams that Boise's Matteo Jorgensen will relive for his second run at the Tour de France, the 21 stage three week race. So I was trying to think of what we could do to make him feel good and to give him some hometown support. Before Matteo returns to the biggest stage in cycling, his mom Sherry, along with other family, coaches and friends, gathered on downtown Boise's Basque Block. His team is based in the Basque country and the tour starts this year in the Basque country. Hey Matteo, what are you doing? You know, Matteo, from, you know, the time that he started was always excited about riding bikes. A love that started with mountain biking in the Boise foothills and shifted to the roads alongside Douglas Torben, director of bird cycling and Mateo's youth coach for more than 11 years. We had bi great bike handling skills, great determination. And, you know, he just, by trying to ride with all the older kids, he just got better, right? He just always in improved. and. You know, he won his first national championship at age 11, 12. And Mateo has continued winning into his 20s. Earlier this year, he took first overall at the Tour of Oman. He's demonstrated um, in the last few years that he's continued to grow, you know, and continued to develop at that level and, you know, build the endurance and the strength to to race at that level. A level that Mateo has made it to alongside another Boise native, Will Barta, who also races for the Basque Country based Movistar cycling team. Two Boise kids trying to make it big on the world tour stage cycling amongst huge cycling fans in Europe. Both of those boys, Mateo, Will, they're living the dream. You know, they're the guys who've worked hard and Stuck it out. While Mateo prepares for the race on the other side of the Atlantic Ocean, his family here in Boise has a message hey, for him. Mateo, we've gathered some friends to send you some wishes. Happy birthday, Mateo. Go out there and do it. Represent well. Ali! Remain focused, Mateo. <laughs> Opa! Oh! Now, the Tour de France starts on July 1st, which also happens to be Mateo's 24th birthday. And his parents told me they'll be out there along the course for each day of the race. And like you said, he did really well last year, finishing in the 20s out of all those racers. So, man, maybe he can even move up higher than that this year. It's going to be fun to follow along. Jude, thank you so much.